Welcome back to Hogwarts Legacy. In the last episode, we had trouble trying to figure out where Dogweed and Deathcap was. I thought it might be a shop in Hogsmeade, but I couldn't find it on the map. And after doing a very, very quick Google search, it turns out there is a shop in the north end that is hidden by the UI. I didn't scroll apart far enough, but there it is, look. It's right there. So I'm dumb, I'm an idiot. We found it, let's go see if we can get on to the next set of quests for my favourite Professor Garlic. I'm looking forward to going. Hogsmeade, here I come. Let's do this. Uh, can I broomstick from here? No. Cannot, but I can take the book. Where'd it go? Hey, it went over there. Give me that book. Give me that piece of paper. I saw it flying around, guys. Did they just vanish? I thought they would just continue flying around. Hmm. Guess not. Must be, it'll have to be quicker next time, I guess. Oh, the, ah, here it is. Got it. And I also need to uh, do a bit of the old sneak, sneak, sneak. Get into this chest, 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 and get lots of money, money, money. Oh, can I broomstick now? No. No broomsticking in Hogsmeade, mate. Ooh. Nice painting you got there. That's cheating. You can't do painting with a wand. Might as well get AI, AI to do it. Jeez. Hey, guys. Come on inside. Revelio. Well, first thing I'm going to do... All the goblins away. I'm going to find your butterfly. I'm going to go find a chimney. Is there a chimney anywhere around here? Oh man, I'm always doing side quests. That's a chimney. It was not the right type of chimney. It was a very square chimney. Looking for a square chimney. Okay, it's not immediately obvious, so we're not going that way. Let's go back. Oh, there it is. I found it, guys. Oh, hang on a minute. There's a book. No, I don't want Incendio. Clearly on the wrong thing. There we go. In my book, guys. Now we need to find Butterfly. Sometimes there it is. It seems all roads. Lumos. I found your Butterfly. You're welcome. Yourself, and now what I'm going to do, I'm going to steal your money. Oh, hang on a minute. I need to sneak, though. Sneak, 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 sneak. Going to steal your money from here. And I'm going to steal whatever you got in here. Thank you very much. And now we'll have a chat. Ready? Boo. Hello. Oh, hello. Whew. Sorry I'm in a bit of a tizzy. I was just scolding some of the plants for spitting and nipping. I suppose it's my own fault for putting more than four to a tray. By the way, Beatrice Green is the name, but you may address me as Madam Green. Okay, well, Buzz. Welcome to Dogweed and Deathcap. Oh, uh, mind you don't knock the mandrakes. Speaking of mandrakes, I need some mandrakes. I demand for antidotes. I wouldn't need to... Except, of course, for curses. And, well, if you be... Mind you don't knock the mandrakes. How many times are you going to tell me about that? What do you have for sale? Nothing. Go away. Well, what say we show you some of what's available? Chinese uh, mandrake seed. Yes, we're going to need some of that. Oh, I'm always thrilled. Uh, that and we're going to need some of that. And, oh, we can actually far. buy some mandrake. So we'll buy a couple of those. Uh, we've got some cabbages. And we'll buy a couple of the venomous... Oh, wow, that's... Wow, we've just burnt through nearly all of our money. Oof. Oof. Doors always open. I'd do anything for you, Miss, uh, my professor, whatever your name is. I remember your name because you're so important to me. Professor Garlic. Right. Spend all my money on getting the things you need me to get. I need the map. I was already on the map. We now need to go and grow our stuff. 
Oh my goodness. Press the right button. Uh, right, we... I could really do to go to the room of requirement, which I guess is this one up here. Secret rooms. Room of requirement. And we'll go and get these things growing. They'll probably take four years to grow. Oh, we did actually buy some things, but we'll get these growing anyway. Um, where's my growing station? It's very dark in here. Dude, can you, uh, can you make it lighter? Me. I'd like to ask you about changing. Of course. Uh, I want it to feel warm like and cozy, please. Huh. Sunshine would be nice. There we go. It's better. That's better. I can actually see in here now. Right. Okay. So, yes. Small planter. We will plant... Hmm, Dittany would be useful, but we're going to plant... Yeah, we'll, we'll plant that. Going to be ready in 10 minutes. We, can we do anything with this? I'm sure we had a a potion thing, did we not? Was that not a potion thing? Huh, maybe not. Okay, in that case, uh, we need to acquire and use a venomous tentacular. Acquire and use a mandrake on multiple enemies simultaneously. So we need to find some enemies. And I think the easiest way to find some enemies would be to pick up another quest line, which is the butterflies one, and head out to the Forbidden Forest. Because, of course, there's going to be uh, bad guys at the Forbidden Forest. That makes sense. Let's head back to the world map, if I can press the right buttons. And the Forbidden Forest is over here. And I think she said it was near the entrance. Yeah, it was. So we'll fast travel to there and see what we can find. Nice to see you, my young friend. Right, where is me objective? Uh, that's this way. So we should probably prepare to use the venomous tentacular first. Huh. I found the are. butterflies, bro. She wasn't making it up. What do I need to do with them? Oh, I have to follow where they go, well, do I? Come this far. Miss Willard's he might get an answer about these butterflies. Oh, hang on. Just get a couple of leeches while I'm here. Can't beat some leeches. Oh, they're going back that way. Hang on. Wait for me, butterflies. More leeches. There they are. Want oh, some moonstone over there as well. Sorry to scare off all of the uh, the deer. I need the moonstone, guys. <gasps> They've come to a chest. Oh, well, look what we have here. Right. Okay. Well, we've done that. So now we need to find some bad guys. So let's head. Further into the Forbidden Forest. I'm sure we'll come across something of value. Bad guys wise. Just jump in the river. Didn't any bad guys, guys. Oh, we've been here before. I recognise this place. I'm sure we can find some bad guys. Where's all the bad guys, guys? I find leeches. Not ever too useful to me, but uh, I'm sure they will be in the future. There's a waterfall here. Is this not where I came for my little cave mission? It might be. Come on, I'm right inside the root of the Forbidden Forest. There's got to be things around here for somewhere. And I need to... Was it the Mandrake for multiple enemies, or was it... Or was it the uh, vernaculus, spectaculus, the mandrake on multiple enemies? So maybe we should equip that first in case we accidentally kill people too quickly. So uh, let's equip mandrake. Find some bad guys. How hard could it be to find bad guys? Jeez. 
I'm in all of the wrong kinds of places, guys. I'm literally out here all on my own. Just young, innocent. I'm not. Ah, here we go. Found a bad guy. We've got one dark mongrel. Have you got any friends? You got no friends, mongrel? Okay, in that case, we shall use venomous, venomous tentacular on you. Okay. Hey, you're supposed to be getting got by the Venanimus Vernaculus. Jeez. Well, I guess that kind of worked. Uh, we need multiple enemies now. Go into this field and see if we can find multiple enemies. This sort of field has multiple enemies written all over it. Now, I don't know if flying around on my broomstick would be a good idea. Whether or not we would uh, actually find any, any enemies doing that. Oh, I can't go on my broomstick here. Okay. Enough. We found some balloons, though. Sheep, are you bad guys? Bad sheep. Wasn't me, it was Tim. Can I use my broom now? Why can't I use my broom? What's the point in having a broom if I can't use it? I'm out here, no one can see me. It's all it's all fine. Oh, that's a long way down. Oh. I found bad guys. Can I get down there? You can feed a beast, or it can feed you. I prefer the latter. I heard. I'll check your pocket. Hey guys, how would you like a mandrake? And then how would you like to blow up? Oh, it sucks to be you, mate. Oh, you all died. They're just sleeping. No, they're dead. They killed them. I did have a cadaver. Good. Right, let's go see my favourite Mrs. Garlic. After we picked up these jumping toadstools. Do a bit of fast travel. Hogwarts maps, please. Yep, yeah, we're still selected on that. That's good. And we want to be going down here. The library annex. Is it gonna? Are you gonna show me? Jeez. There we go. Now, is this conversation going to be full of innuendo too? Or was it just me overthinking things this morning when I was recording that other episode? Look who it is, Miss, your favourite student. Like cabbage. Just me and you now, miss. Everyone's gone. How wonderful to see you again. I thought you might say that. I've, uh, I've been thinking about you a lot. As I've been travelling around the castle. I was wondering if uh, you might show me your cabbages just one more time. I've completed my assignments, Professor. Pleased to hear it. Professor Weasley will be, too. I'll be sure to let her know how well you're coming along. Thank you, Professor. Professor Hecate tells me she taught you Levioso, so you should be ready for a more advanced levitation charm. Wingardium Leviosa requires a bit of concentration and a nice, graceful wand movement. Let's see you try a your A nice, graceful out. wand movement, you say? When executed correctly, you should be able to pick up boulders as though they were sprigs of smithboard. Did I do it right, Miss? Control its position with your movement. Oh, okay, we can. Oh, okay, that's handy. Nice. Well done! Feel free to practice Wingardium Leviosa here in the greenhouse. I've set some crates out for you in the next room. 
You seem provocatively bent over the uh, the, the thing there, miss. I, I don't want to, you know, talk out of line here, but it's almost as if you're, you're doing it on Professor purpose. Garlic, a moment of your time? The plants are resting, so now's as good a time as any. What made you want to teach herbiology? Herbiology? I was herbology. Wondering, what made you want to teach herbology? How lovely of you to ask. I've always had an affinity for greenery, so this situation is a bit of a dream come true. After graduation, I was thrilled to be asked to step in for my old herbology professor. He'd had a slight accident, you see. Oh dear. A shame for him, but it worked out well for you. Hmm. Well, he never and now us really cared for the plants and they could sense it oh you'd be surprised how perceptive a plant can be at any rate the trouble began one day when he cut into a wigan tree unfortunately for him its leaves were hiding a bow truckle you may recall the marvelous creatures that resemble a twig the little beast gouged the professor's eyes quite fiercely but terrifying i'd imagine uh, likely for the professor too and that's when you took over as the herbology professor? Well, not quite. After three weeks at St. Mungo's, my predecessor regained a tiny bit of his eyesight. He insisted on returning to the greenhouse. Within a week, he had, he claims by accident, kicked a Chinese chomping cabbage. So it was back to St. Mungo's for him. That's almost <laughs> comical. A fair bit of bad luck there, I'd say. Hmm. Well... I felt awful for him, but I dare say I felt a bit more sympathy for the cabbage. Upon his discharge from the hospital, his indifference to plants had turned to utter disdain. He lost what little patience he had left with a particularly temperamental venomous tentacular and... Well, his resulting leave of absence continues to this day. I'm glad everything worked out as it did and that you're the herbology professor now. Very kind of you to say. I do love these gardens and helping my students grow. Ha! Huh. Lovely speaking with you. Have a wonderful day. Oh, and remember, be kind to your Wigan trees. I will. I will treat them with care and respect that they deserve. Yeah, maybe it was just because uh, it was first thing in the morning for me earlier. It just, that didn't seem to uh, be all that, you know, interesting really. Well, what am I doing with this? Or is this my new Wingardium Leviosa thing that I can do? Okay, so let's uh, let's go and equip it, I guess. So it's this one, and we're going to equip that, uh, I guess, here. Because I think we've already got the Heidi one up there. Yeah, we have. So try it. Wingardium Leviosa. You're a natural. And it said I could use... Oh, yeah, the, the D-pad to move it backwards and forwards. Doesn't seem to move it left and right though. Oh, I can spin it with those. Oh, interesting. Okay, nice. Is there anything I can do with this? Is there anywhere I can put it to be helpful or is it just there to mess about with? I've always wanted to mess about with uh, Professor Dalek's box. Oh, that was fun. A good time was had by all. Right. It's time to move on. I guess uh, that quest didn't quite lead where I was hoping it would, but not to worry. Let's go and uh, acquire an invisibility potion, acquire and use a thunder, -proof a thunder brew potion and use against enemies. Okay, so we need to go shopping again. And I think this will be our last sort of side questy thing until we get back on the main line. Uh, we, because we also need to go to Hogsmeade to see our friend at the pub in order to give her the news about the fireflies. So we'll go there and then we'll go to the, in fact, we'll do the potions first because it's closest to the fast travel point. And then we'll go to the pub, see, talk to her about the butterflies, hopefully get some kind of nice reward. And then we'll hopefully go back to our teacher. Get and um, cozy than Hogsmeade? Uh, yeah, learn some new stuff. Okay, uh, potion shop. According to the map, it was right here. Is it this one? Or am I being forgetful? No, it's this one here. There it is. Welcome. Do you let me know. Oh, I haven't done your delivery yet. At all. What can I do for you today? I need to buy uh, some potions. Dench of the dead. No, I need invisibility. 
which I might already have, actually. Oh, I've got the ones that I'm supposed to be carrying for you. 500? Jeez, and what was the other one I needed? Thunderbrew. 1,000? Oh, my goodness me. Huh. I guess we're going to need to earn some more money then. See you again. Farewell mm. for now. Right, well, let's go to the pub then. <laughs> Jeez. And then uh, once we've been to the pub, we'll uh, we'll go and do his delivery mission instead of going on the main line and see if we can earn some more money. So let's uh, set our waypoint to the pub. Which is uh, sort of in this direction a bit, I guess. Can I jump over those? Thank you very much. Good, mate. Coming through. Hey, guys. Oh, please do me. For me about the butterflies. You do. Hello, Miss Willardy. Well, what happened? Did you find them? They led me into the forest and revealed a treasure. Oh, how lovely. I'm glad you were rewarded for your efforts. <sighs> Perhaps one day I'll be able to bring myself to go into the forest. For now, I'm happy simply knowing there's something so lovely to see. Should I dare? Okay, then. Right. Uh, actually, before we move on, we've got a bunch of gear that we need to go through and probably sell some of this as well. So that's locked until our next level, and it's not actually all that good anyway. So we could get rid of that. Let's just make sure we've got everything that's the best we can equipped. See, we need to equip those because they're better. And then we need to turn them off because they're stupid. We don't have any headwear. We do have some new ones of these. That's worse and that is worse. So that's good. We've got the best one of those. The cloaks are both worse. So they're no good. And the neckwear. We do have a new one, but that's worse as well. So I think we're pretty much on the best we can get with the equipment we've got. So that means we can sell pretty much everything else. Clear a load of space in our inventory. Hopefully get some more money. At least buy a couple of those potions. Or at least one of them. And then we just need to focus on getting a, bit more, a little bit more money to get the other. Whereas this way, the potion shop, I believe. Here it is. We're back. In the Need to sell you some junk. Buy it all, mate. I don't need any of it. Sell. 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 Where's the sell all button? I don't think that's... Oh, that might have given us enough just to get... Just enough to get both. So we needed one invisibility, which technically we've got four because we've got one supposed to deliver, and one Thunderbrew. There we go. We've got just enough. And the to see you again. job was... Oh, it's already on screen. What was it? What does it say? Acquire and use an invisible potion. Acquire and use a Thunderbrew potion against enemies. So we now need some more enemies. So if we do go and try and do this quest, which was the delivery one, we should probably come across enemies on that because I believe that's a, a reasonable distance away. So let's equip our Thunderbrew potion. And let's see if we can uh, find this place we're delivering to. Can we use our... No, why can't we use our broom? Whoa! How did I do that? That didn't work earlier. But it is working now. Wow. Okay. Nice. Oh, it's a, it's a good way away. Where we're going. Oh, jeez. Oh, and there's a bit of floaty paper. Mine. Can I go on my broom now? Why can I never use my broom? What's the point in having it? Maybe I'm only allowed to use it inside of Hogwarts for now. Oh no, I can use it here. That's so weird. Okay. In that case, 
Let's burn over to where we're going then. Oh, that's a that's a long way away. Going as fast as I can. We need the upgrade on this as well. That guy still hasn't done that for us. And there is a clothes shop in town. I wonder if we go there, we could buy some of the uh, special items that we need to upgrade some of those weapons. And going by broom isn't quite as fast as I thought it might be. Although I don't think I've got a fast travel point in that direction. Maybe we have. We do. Where are we actually heading to? Oh, we're going all the way over here. So if we fast travel to this point here, then we can broom from there. Jeez, it's a long way to go. Having said that, we don't want to broom in because we need to find enemies. So we might as well just run along the path and see if we come across any bad guys. I'm sure there'll be plenty of bad guys through these woods. Although it's still a reasonable distance. Any bad guys around here? No. I wonder if we skirt along the path like this. We can still be going at a reasonable speed. We may discover enemies. Ah, there we go. I've discovered enemies. Hey, guys. Oh, they're, they're fighting the spider. Okay. Oh, you're still alive. See you there. Not anymore. Where did that lightning come from? Did I do that? Oh, is that the thunder potion that I got? Okay. I see. That makes sense. Okay, so we did that one. Nice. What was the other thing we needed to do? Just drink an invis invisibility potion, wasn't it? Yeah. Okay, we can do that as well. No problem. I'll just just have one. Just one. Yes. Now I'm completely invisible. And now I'm completely visible. Huh. Well, that lasted a long time. It's delivery time. I'm looking forward to being able to get a faster broom or at least a faster way of getting around. We should be keeping our eyes on the uh, those flame things as well if we can. Oh, there's a red arrow here. What's that? Bad guys? Hello there. How difficult are you going to be to kill? Oh, there's a hippogriff there. Where'd it go? It won one. Right, where's this uh, evil thing? Beat an enemy with venomous tentacular. I still got to do that. Okay. Defeat an enemy with it. Enemy with it. Uh, let's equip it then. Oops. <laughs> they got wet. Oh, he's quite strong. Eat venomous tentacle thing. I mean, I could do to get him really weak so that thing can kill it. Because I've got, I can, I've got my finisher, but I don't want to, I don't want to kill it because I want the that thing to kill him. Now, hey, there he goes. Oh, the venomous thing's gone now. Oh well. Maybe I'll. Uh, get it anyway just for defeating him. Did I get it? No. Oh well. I got some dug bog tongue though. Room up. Let's go. I'm surprised there isn't a uh, like a flame thing here. There is a Merlin's... Oh, there is. There's a flame thing here. 
How nice to see you, my young friend. I was going to say, there's a Merlin's thing here. Merlin's thing. Okay, so this one, it looks like we have some wheels. That Pippin should have We're going to have a really now. good time with this one. Oh, it's balls, it's not wheels. What am I supposed to do with those balls? I guess we're going to need Wingardium Leviosa. Wingardium Leviosa. And where do I take it? Oh, got to hold it. Okay. Uh, try not to get stuck in the tree. Oh, wrong button. Wingardium Leviosa. That Pippin should have been here by now. Where am I supposed to put it? Do I put it over here? I don't think so. Hmm. Always leak that pippin. You can stop a thief in their tracks with stupefy. Hmm. Not overly obvious. <laughs> Apparently I've dropped it. Oops. Or did it go back to Not where it started? That Pippin should have been here by now. Oh, there's a little cloud there. What am I supposed to do with that then? Revelio. You would think there would be more than. <gasps> That's in that house, and that house is locked. But there's only one ball kicking about around here. It doesn't appear to be anywhere to put it. Can we go in here? We can. Take your stuff. As you think it belongs to you, but it belongs to me now. This house is all kind of on a weird angle. Hmm. Let's, no, let's uh, let's fly for a second. Let's see if we can figure out where we're supposed to go with that. That Pippin should have been here by now. It just doesn't seem like there's an obvious place to put that ball. Unless we're supposed to just like roll it down the hill. Oh, what's this up here? It's just a dude in a field, okay. Just a dude in a field, man. It's a shame we can't um, use magic whilst on our brooms. Maybe that'll unlock later. Is there anything over this side that we could use it on? We've got a whole circle of things going on over here. Sounds like bad guys. Hmm. Just try rolling it down the hill and see what happens. That Pippin should have been here by now. Wingardium Leviosa. Or do we just drop it? Always leak that pit. What am I supposed to do with this ball? Excuse me, chaps. I don't suppose you've got any idea what I'm supposed to do with this ball. Have you? Wow, you've got strong heads. Do I put it on this table? No, but I do get one of those. Hmm. It would appear I have no idea what I'm doing with this one. Nope. Oh well. Maybe I'm not supposed to put it anywhere. Maybe I'm just supposed to, like, open it or something. Goodness. I need to get the other side of that. Good me. This is mine. All of your things belong to me now. I'm the new good boy in town. Very good boy. Take your things, because I'm good boy. 
Oh, I tipped someone. I give you things. Okay. I don't suppose you happen to know what I'm supposed to do with this stupid bowl, do you? Madam Luang, I have a delivery from J. Pippin's potions. Ha! <laughs> Sent a child to do his work for him. Always cutting corners. Did he have your brew them for him? Doesn't matter. Here are the potions you requested. You think it's so? I know Pippin is up. Cutting corners to save some. You'll not be getting a can. Drink it. Seems simple enough. I should think so. Drink an invisibility potion. Literally did that a minute ago, mate. There you go. It seems to have worked. Hmm. Well, I suppose that will do. If the demand for potions is as high as you say, have you considered being easier to work with? Perhaps <laughs> combining your recipes and skills? Ha! <laughs> Not a chance. That ne'er do well had his shop handed to him. The rest of us had to make our own way. Very well. You do that. What do you have for sale? What are we looking for today? Um, not a lot, really, to be honest with you. I would like to know how to put what Thank I'm supposed to do with that ball. In. I appreciate it. Must be something to do with it. Why would it exist if there's nowhere to put it? Right. Um, I'm going to try and cast a bunch of other potion uh, things on it, but uh, I'm not convinced it's going to do anything. Accio. Confringo. Levioso. Expelliarmus. Accio. I can drag it about. And I can pick it up. But I can't do anything with it. It's dumb. Wingardium Leviosa. Where is it supposed to go? Nobody knows. In here. Is it does it go underwater? I want to know. I don't want to leave this thing. Revelio. There's literally nothing. Nothing anywhere. Seems pleasant enough little place. That's like lit up that would suggest that I can use that on. I'd like to go in here because there's a bunch of chests in there. Right. Okay. Forget that then. Moving on. Moving on, jeez, I didn't realise how long this episode had been already. Uh, I guess we're going to go see Professor Garlic again in a minute. We're also going to go back to Professor Sharp. And I say in a minute for me, going to be on the next episode for you. I'll see you all in the next one. <laughs>